Well, President Biden is visiting California right now. He's touring the extensive damage from recent deadly storms. He touched down actually in Santa Clara County just a short time ago. Among other events, the president is scheduled to meet with business owners and residents, as well as visit first responders and state officials. And this all comes after the president today increased assistance to the hard hit areas under a disaster declaration for California. Our Zach Fuentes from our ABC affiliate KGO joining me now from Moffett Field Airport there in Santa Clara County where President Biden just landed. So Zach, what do we know about President Biden's agenda today? Tell us more. Yeah, so far it all started early. He was set to get here at 1210 our time. He got here about 20 minutes before that. So now that he's here, he transferred from Air Force One behind me to a helicopter where he's going to go to one of the regional airports closest to where the hardest hit damage has been. He's going to be there and then at about 150 our time. So an hour or so from now, he's going to be heading over to the areas getting that have been hit the hardest, the businesses, the homes, after getting an aerial view from that helicopter of the damage. And those areas in Capitola, a city in Santa Cruz County, and Aptos are some of the areas that have been hit the hardest by our winter storms and by high surf that's come through the area as well. And Zach, just kind of describe what you've seen. You, you know, you're a reporter there on the ground, where you have gone, what's sort of moved you the most of what you've witnessed in your state there. And also, you know, what exactly do Californians need right now, you know, at this hour, you think? Well, there is absolutely a reason that the president is going to the locations that he is going to. We were up there. We've been up there for several weeks. The first week we were there, the business is along what's called the Capitola Pier, a very popular city that attracts a lot of tourists in Santa Cruz County, was just devastated. These businesses gutted by high surf that came in one day the first week of the year. It was about 8 a.m. that this high surf came in, and by 11 a.m. that same day, these businesses were gutted, red tagged, yellow tagged, meaning they could not get in their business to see even get what little belongings were still in there. So the amount, the dollar amount in damage is just countless for these businesses and for the homes along the area. There was sand packed inside of these businesses, packed inside some of the homes in the area. And so right now, the aid that people are looking for is just some more of that FEMA assistance that's already here. We have 500 FEMA personnel in the area, some low-cost loans possibly, because the other thing here that we've been reporting on is that insurance a lot of times doesn't cover some of the damage that these homeowners and business owners have been faced with. So landslides, flooding, their insurance might not be covering that. Most insurance policies, in fact, might not be covering that. So any government assistance that these businesses and homeowners can get will be greatly needed, greatly appreciated. So, Zach, you know, the president said that he's listening um, and listening to those needs tonight. He is going to make, as you know, uh, a speech uh, on his commitment to supporting the people there in hard hit California. Um, what do you think residents want to hear? Well, you know, I think they want to hear, yeah, yes, that aid is coming, more federal aid is coming. They want to hear a message of hope, too. One of the business owners I spoke with told me when I asked him, you know, what's happening next for you? He said he didn't know. His response to me was, what do you do when you've lost your purpose? And that's something that's echoed by many of the business owners, many of the homeowners in that area throughout Santa Cruz County. And, you know, it's even beyond the areas that the president will be able to visit today. Capitol and Aptos, two cities in Santa Cruz County. But there are other hard hit areas as well, low income areas, people who just don't have the means to be able to rebuild on their own without some kind of assistance. So people are really going to want to hear that assistance is coming and that the president is paying attention that he is hearing their concerns so right now we have the president with our local leaders governor newsom senator alex padilla they're meeting face to face so hopefully that will result in some kind of action for these people who have just been devastated by these recent storms and the impacts that continue to come as a result of the storms kira all right well we will follow it zach appreciate uh, all the latest information as the president just got off the plane there uh, in uh, california uh, in uh, at Moffett Field there outside of San Francisco. Thanks so much, Zach.